Hi guys and welcome back to another segment of the 5 Minute Singer. Thank you very much for joining me, I really do appreciate it. In this segment we're going to be talking about how to use your high mixed or blended voice. Now in last week's episode I did give you an example of some different blended or mixed voices. So I'm going to give you another example here. I'm a baritone, I like to sing in my middle to lower range, I'm going to be singing a tenor song, okay. Um, we're going to be singing uh, Roxanne by the police, okay? Roxanne, you don't have to put on the red lights Those days are over You don't have to sell your body to the nights Roxanne, you don't have to wear the dress tonight Let's fast forward to the chorus, okay, the high bit Put on the red lights Put on the red lights! Okay, and on and on. So that is mixed or blended voice. And that is very, very high for me to sing. That's a, a female register, basically. Before you start using mixed or blended voice, or even doing this particular segment, please make sure that you are completely warmed up with the warm-up exercise that I have already previously given you, and possibly even a crying scale uh, before you start doing this particular scale here because the crying technique is very, very important in this scale because we are going to be what we call at Vox called revving a cry into this particular scale. Now, let's talk about mixed or blended voice. Placement, firstly. I want you to feel that the sounds are being placed to the back of the head. They're sliding back. So when we're doing these scales, they're going... Oh! They're going... Oh! Um, vibrating and, and, and resonating in my head is ah, don't think ah, down here. I don't want it down here. I want a feminine sound as we're going back. So feel that the sound's being placed back to the back of the head here. We want to keep moving over what we call the crack or the break between the true voices because there is a crack or a break between true voice and falsetto. If I go slowly over this register, ah. My noticeable break in my voice. So another hint here, let's move quickly over this area. Okay, we want to move quickly over the crack or the break. Keep it light and feminine, especially for the males and females as well, too, but keep it light and feminine. Try to sound as feminine as you possibly can, males. Um, and we want to rev a cry through the scale. Okay, so I'm going to give you some examples here. What I mean by revving a cry is you start with a little bit of a cry at the start, but you get more cry as we go up through the scale, like that, okay? So, have a listen to me, males. We're gonna start down low here, where you should be feeling comfortable. We're gonna move very quickly through the scale on an octave jump. It's going to be, ah, we wanna move that quick, and we wanna put that, ah, that sob through the scale. Let's do that, males. Ah, this is my motorbike, it's my cry, and I'm revving the cry as I go through the scale. Ah, and I'm moving very quickly. Ah, females more than welcome to join me here as well too. Ah, let's move quickly. Ah, ah, keep it going. Ah, now I'm tightening my stomach as I'm inclining the scale. I'm not belting the scale, I'm trying to keep the sound going back to the back of my head here. Not ah, don't no, push it down, it's ah, let it go back. Take it down, one note here, ah, let it slide back. Now rev that little sob, so it's going ah, and the sound's going back, let's keep it going, join me at home, ah, let's keep it going back, ah, it's gonna move quickly, ah, Fantastic scale. It's a very difficult scale though, so please, again, make sure that you're warmed up, you're revving the cry through the scale, you're letting the sound slide back to the back of the head. Thank you very much for joining me here today. I really do appreciate 
all of the views. Thank you very much for all the positive comments as well too. I love all you guys and we'll see you next week. Hope this segment has helped you out. Bye-bye.